Page 6 Neha's Alarm Clock Narrator Ring, ring, ring. Off goes the alarm clock at 6 in the morning. Neha makes a face and covering her ears with a pillow, snuggles under the warm blanket. But she knows. She has to get up. She mutters to herself. Neha This alarm clock always rings at 6 and pulls me out of the bed. It's so unfair. Oh, how I would love to sleep a little longer in the morning. I wish this clock would forget its job sometimes. Narrator Something falls. Neha smiles. Neha Oh, my clock has fallen. How happy I am. Tomorrow I can get up late. Narrator Next morning, there is no alarm. So Neha sleeps and sleeps. Page 7 The small chirpy birds which come to the window seal every morning find Neha still sleeping. Birds Wake up, dear! Wake up fast! Narrator Neha gets up with a start. Neha Oh no! If it's not the alarm clock, it's these birds. Why don't they leave me alone? Narrator Even this wish of Neha's come true. The next morning, there is not only no alarm clock, there are no birds either. But there is someone else who does not want her to miss the school bus. Can you guess who it is? The big bright sun. He fills Neha's room with a warm smile. Page 8 Neha Oh, my eyes! Now it's the sun waking me up. Why can't he let me be? Narrator Even this wish of Neha's come true. Next morning, the sun is behind the clouds. So, Neha snores till she hears her mother's voice. Mother Wake up, sleepy head. You will miss the bus. Neha Oh no! Why does mother have to wake me up? Narrator There is no escape now. Neha gets up and gets ready. Can you imagine what happens the next day? Neha wakes up with a start. Her watch says it's six o'clock. She calls out to her mother. Neha Ma, who woke me up today? Page 9 Mother who else? You, of course. Neha But I was sleeping. How could I? Mother, now tell me, why do you eat your lunch every day at one in the afternoon? Neha I feel hungry. Mother, why do you sleep at nine every night? Neha, because I feel sleepy. Mother, there is a clock inside you which tells you when to eat, when to sleep and when to wake up. Neha, oh, oh, I better rush now. I don't want to miss the bus. Mother, relax. Today is Sunday. Neha Oh! Oh! Adapted from Neha's Alarm Clock by Girija Rani Asthana New Words Snuggles Mutters Windowsill 
relax. Page 10 Reading is fun. Take the correct answer in the box given below. 1. What time did Neha's clock ring every morning? A. 4 o'clock B. 9 o'clock C. 6 o'clock 2. What did the bird say? A. Sleep on B. Wake up C. Go and play 3. A. Our body clock B. Our eyes C. Our feet 4. Put the letters in the right order. One has been done for you. I L E S M S M I L E Smile M R A L A Blank O C K L C Blank N O R M I N G Blank E D O R M S Blank W O D W I N Blank Page 11 Let's listen and talk. 1. Listen to the sounds around you when you are on your way to school. Discuss with your friend the sounds that you heard. List them here. Sounds you heard? Blank, 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 blank. Sounds your friend heard? Blank, 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 blank. Two. If there is no clock in the house to wake you in the morning, how will you wake up? Will you continue to sleep or? 3. What are the different ways of knowing the time during the day? Page 12 Word Building Find the hidden words Mother Birds Clock Alarm Happy Morning Holiday Hungry Sunday A grid has been given below. Say aloud Ought Bought Caught Matter Chatter Shatter Take Talk Tell Told Train Time Tick Tack Tip Tin Take Tall Page 13 Let's write 1. Who said these words and to whom? Wake up, dear. Wake up fast. Who said? Blank. To whom? Blank. Ma, who woke me up today? Who said? Blank. To whom? Blank. Why do you sleep at nine every night? Who said? Blank. To whom? Blank. 
2. Use the help box to fill in the blanks. There are two words in the help box. Was, were. A. Ram, blank, a good football player. B. The cows, blank, grazing in the field. C. My toys, blank, broken. D. Her frock, blank, too long. E. The market, blank, closed. F. The children, blank, happy. G. The flowers, blank, kept in a vase. Page 14. 3. Look at the pictures below and complete the following paragraph. You will need these words. The words are Pulled out Inside Called out Behind Under Yesterday I lost a book. I looked for it everywhere. I looked blank. A door. I looked blank. A cupboard. I looked blank. A bed. I could not find it anywhere. Then I blank. Shiro. Shiro, my dog, came running to me. I asked him to look for my book. He blank another book from my bag. Page 15 Fun time! Here is a word clock. Write down words relating to clock. Sound Box has been provided. Another word Box has been provided. Picture Box has been provided. Word in your language Box has been provided. Name different parts or times Box has been provided. Make a sentence Box has been provided. Here is a word, morning. Now write down words related to it. Page 16. Teacher's page. Unit 1. Poem, Wake Up. Story, Neha's Alarm Clock. Themes, The Importance of Time, Appreciating Nature. This unit focuses on appreciation of the beauty in nature the magic of words and to give children experiences in expressing their feelings. This unit is also a listening unit. It gives children something to listen to as you read the poem to them. Ask children why they like the poem and read the poem again for interesting and beautiful sounds. Begin this unit by pointing to the pictures and ask children what beautiful colours they see. Provide a print-rich environment. Warm-up. It is important to do warm-up exercises related to the theme, like let children stretch their arms, exercise and jog as if to wake up wide. Relate this to the natural beauty of the morning. Reading time. Read the chapter to the students at a stretch, giving the meanings of the new and difficult words so that they can understand the text. Use appropriate words, expressions, phrases in different situations. This can help you to assess the child's ability to listen with attention for a reasonable length of time. Share the main idea of the text and accelerate recall skills. 
give the children a chance to read individually sharing time involve the class in a group reading session let children add meaning with voice modulation and body gestures dramatize the play for the morning assembly let each child express what they feel when they have to get up in the morning team time play memory games you can write down 10 new words from the lesson on the blackboard let the children look at the words for 2 minutes ask the children to close their eyes you can then erase one word the children will then open their eyes and identify the word that has been erased since breakfast is important for good health each child could be asked what he had for breakfast then ask them to give the importance of milk lassi butter let them add what they eat will like to eat discuss the importance of time and punctuality with the class let them add what they eat or will like to eat discuss the importance of time and punctuality with the class while discussing other ways of finding time the sundial shadows and position of sun can be introduced environment create a junior green brigade as a group of keen environmentalists who assist in keeping the school green and clean they can be actively involved in successful projects against crackers and banning the use of poly bags in the school and community the school can encourage cloth bags which are an attractive and environment friendly alternative to plastic